you hold me I rather lost my senses than be lonely cuz baby when you touch me I feel hope oh nothing in the world will oh will kill me as long as I got you I was running from myself those days Always breathless search for something safe And then I smashed into that golden face And for the first time I don't run away We danced together till we got it right Ups and downs through many days and nights But you appear to be my guiding light And at the same time So I went and got my groceries early this morning. So I was in a kind of like a big hurry to hurry and get Jason to his doctor appointment. So I completely forgot to do an intro for y'all. So we're going to flash forward to the future and I'm going to do an intro for y'all. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. My name is Bethany or Budget Bethany and welcome to my weekly grocery haul. So I like to share these every single week in hopes to give y'all some meal ideas on my meal plan and some inspiration to stick to a budget as well. So I did go to Walmart this week and I did Walmart grocery pickup and I also will share my menu with y'all. I didn't go to Pickle Weekly again this week just because it's easier for me to go to Walmart and just get everything I need from there. So we're just going to hop right on into this week's grocery haul. So let's go y'all. All right, y'all, so since I'm just sharing three dinners that are gonna be in the crock pot this week, I figured I'd do the menu like this. And two of these recipes we've had before, but we have not had from the crock pot. And one of them is a brand new recipe that we've never tried at all. So one night we're gonna have crock pot Brunswick stew. And I've had Brunswick stew many times over the years of my life, but I've never had it cooked in the crock pot. So I'm gonna give that a try. And then um, number two, which is, they're not in any order. I don't know if they'll be cooked in this order. I just got them one, two, and three. But number two is creamy crock pot spaghetti. And I've never had spaghetti cooked in the crock pot either. So that will be interesting as well. And then number three, I have cheesy buffalo chicken subs. And I think this is my most excited one that I'm excited to try because I just love anything buffalo chicken. So that's going to be our dinners for this week. So if you want to see these dinners, make sure you come back Sunday at 10 a.m. and check out this week's What's for Dinner. Now let's get on into the grocery haul, y'all. All right, y'all, so here is an overview of all the groceries for this week. And if y'all hear the TV in the background, Jace is here today. He was sick. I'm fixing to make him a doctor appointment to take him to the doctor. He just overnight started getting some kind of blisters all over him. So we're going to go have that checked out. But so just ignore the TV in the background. But we're going to start right here. We got some toilet paper. We don't really care about toilet paper. So I just get the cheap brand because you know what it's being used for. Had to get some paper towels out and i also got somehow wound up with two bundles of bananas but i only ordered one so i don't know if maybe the one didn't equal the amount that they were charging me so they gave me another one i don't know but anyway i've got two bundles of bananas but i only ordered one had to get a whole bunch of like canned stuff i just was very low on canned stuff because we've been going through it here lately but i got some salsa this is for a recipe one night this week as well as this wing sauce just got the great value brand I got two cans of spaghetti and I got the hunts in the can. I got traditional and garlic and herb. I got two cans of diced tomatoes. Also, most of these cans are going to be for like recipes this week because I will be doing a crock pot video that will be for this what's for dinner this coming up Sunday. So that's why I have a lot of canned goods as well. Um, these were substitutes. I ordered the great value corn, but they gave me these, which is fine. So I got two cans of those. I also got two cans of sweet peas. I got a can of pumpkin. That's going to be for 
over on my cleaning channel it's time to decorate for fall in the youtube world and i want to kind of make a little pumpkin pie an easy pumpkin pie over there as well during the fall decorate so i only ordered three cans uh oh i only ordered three cans of spaghetti and meatballs but somehow i wound up with six of them three of them being the name brand and three of them being the great value brand so the kids will be really excited about that i had to get some jello vanilla pudding i got me two cans of tuna just for lunches you know while i'm at home by myself the kids are at school i also got me some smoked oysters y'all know i share this many times i put these on saltine crackers with some hot sauce and i'll eat that for lunch I had to get some jalapeno poppers. I'm gonna be making some jalapeno pimento cheese, so that's what those will be used for. And then my pimentos. Here's the ranch packet I dropped while I go. This is for a recipe as well that's I'm cooking this week. Let's see, I had to get some yogurts for the kids. They like to snack on these once they get off the school bus. I got these, I got these mostly for me. These are my favorite, but the kids may have one. I got them all each a Lunchable. These are also good snacks when they come home from school. Sometimes they may take them to school, but most of the time they eat them when they come home. Had to get some lettuce and some tortillas. We're going to have like a um, Mexican dinner, crock pot dinner one night this week. So that's what I need that for, as well as some salad. Got some more of these. I thought it was cuties, but I guess it's called Jim's Easy Peeling Mandarins. My kids love these and they'll eat this bag probably like over the weekend. <laughs> if I'm being honest, I had to get some ground beef. So I just got this mounted because it's just me and the kids. Got two packs of hot dogs. My kids will also come home and take like two of the hot dogs out, cut them up in little circles and put them in the microwave and warm them up a little bit and eat them with ketchup like that sometimes. Got some whip topping. This is also for that pumpkin pie that I'm going to be making on my cleaning channel. Had to get some milk. We were out of milk and Jace is crazy for cereal milk. So I had to keep that. I got a whole bunch of cheeses. Like I said, I'm making pimento cheese, so you need a lot of cheese for that. So I got this big bag. It's a one pound bag of sharp cheddar, finely shredded cheese. I got some Colby Jack cheese and some pepper jack cheese. And then I got three things of the cream cheese. I got these right here. These are for me for like lunch. So just something I can pop in the microwave or the air fryer and, you know, eat. So I got me two of these kind of like hot pocket, great value brand things. And then I got some of the chicken taquitos. I really like those things right there. I had to get some boneless, skinless chicken breast. So I just got this. I prefer to get this. It just seems to me, in my mind, it's a better buy just for me and the kids. Anyway, I got some biscuits. I also like to pop these in the oven and have one for breakfast. Sometimes I scramble some eggs and fry some bacon. And I'll have like a bacon, egg, and cheese biscuit made at home. Not having to go spend no money at a restaurant. And then I got these, and these are also for the Mexican dinner that I'm going to be making in a crock pot this week. And <laughs> when I took this out of the bag, I was like, what the world? Because I thought I ordered like a big bag, but undoubtedly I ordered the small bag. So I guess only one person will probably get some of those. <laughs> and then there's my pie crust. And then here's a big pack of chips for the kiddos to take to school so they can have a snack for recess. And then tell them, hey, Penny. Tell them, hey. And then I also got a, I think it's a 24, no, it's a 40 pack of water for the kiddos to take to school as well. My kids do ride the bus home, so I like to make sure that they take water with them. And then I got a 12 pack of twist ups. Say, hey, Penny. <laughs> but that's everything for this week, y'all. I didn't go to Piggly Wiggly this week. I just wasn't feeling it. Oh yeah, I also got these sub rolls. I forgot to mention those. I just happened to see them. But that's everything. Wasn't feeling the Piggly Wiggly coupons this week, so I didn't go. Just did everything at Walmart, and I did the Walmart grocery pickup. Made my life so much easier. I just dropped the kids out at school, minus Jace, and ran 30 minutes over to the next county over and did my grocery pickup. And I didn't even have to go in the store because y'all know the world right now. You want to stay out the store as much as possible. So that's what I was trying to do. But here was my grocery haul for this week. Oh, baby, when you...